Hi guys, this short little video will show you how to access the logs of your course. So go to your course site, scroll down to reports, go to logs. Once you are in logs, you'll see that this is the course that you are in. You would like to look at all participants, but we can look at individual people as well. Um, we can also look at specific days or all days. So let's maybe look at a nice busy one, I think was that day. We can also look at all activities or we can drill down to specific ones. But in this, this case, we want to see how many people actually access the site. Um, and we also want to see who viewed. This gives you options to see who created, but only teachers can create. So that's not going to 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 <clears throat> make sense but if we're looking at students we want to look at view we can also say you know all events participating so we want to say view and participating so that way the system sees people that can view stuff and people that are participating so theoretically it should exclude teachers but it it unfortunately does pick them up then in terms of log we always have standard log legacy log is if we have a, a previous version of Moodle but we are only looking at the standard. So we say, get these logs. The system will then run <clears throat> and you will see the following. <coughs> Sorry. You'll see the following. So we'll see the user full username, what they actually looked at, and the event name, viewed course, uh, course module viewed. So you'll see that these are always the same because it will tell you we are only looking at this course. But this is the events that they, had, uh, that, that they actually viewed. So we can see who viewed what. Unfortunately, this page is just very long. And at every single click that, that we do, it actually takes us there. But if we want to have a, a broad view of who accessed this is the report that we can look at, if we scroll down right to the bottom of the page, we can also download this as an Excel. And I think in Excel, it, it actually gives us a lot more options. <clears throat> Come on. Okay. So here we can actually see a lot more information. Um, and we can actually see what people looked at. They looked at a page. They went back to the system. They accessed a quiz. They accessed you know, a URL. Um, so we can actually see a lot more. You can see even I viewed. And that's why I say I'm a teacher on this course, so it's not going to exclude teachers. So it's very useful to, to actually pull this off um, and, act, and actually what you can do with this report is, is, is quite um quite a lot. We can sort by username, we can see who accessed. Um, the only downside is it doesn't export student names, uh, student numbers, or email addresses. And that's all about the privacy settings um, that uh, the back end of Are You Connected does not allow for. Um, and that's, a, that's unfortunately something that we're trying to overcome at the moment. Thank you.